everyone. I'm Paul Grilly, and I'd like to talk to you about our online course, A Yogi's Guide to Chakra Meditation. In fact, it's based on this book, A Yogi's Guide to Chakra Meditation. This book will actually be our textbook for this series of theoretical lectures and practices. So, A Yogi's Guide to Chakra Meditation takes Patanjali's view of yoga and its processes and applies it specifically to chakra meditation techniques. So Patanjali lived 2,500 years ago and he wrote a very famous uh, book or series of sutras that's been passed down to us since then. And in this genius of a book, he summarizes the broad general mental processes that occur in the various stages of meditation. Now it wasn't Patanjali's purpose or ideal to promote any specific form of meditation. In fact, if you read his book looking for specific details, you're usually gonna be disappointed. What Patanjali wanted to do was try to discover the science behind all forms of meditation. There are many forms of meditation. They all lead to very good or interesting results, or at least they claim to. And Patanjali's system was to try to describe, no matter who you are, what you believe, what your specific little variations of practice are, what mental processes are universally human that we could trace in everyone who attempts to achieve a level of spiritual insight through meditation. What this course is gonna do is take Patanjali's ideas, outline them, but then apply them specifically in a specific form of meditation, chakra meditation. Now, chakra is not the best form of meditation, it's not the only form of meditation, but it's the form of meditation I'm most familiar with and it's the form of meditation that I practice. So this course is gonna be presenting what's the general overview of the meditative process? What are the various universal states that a meditative spiritual practitioner will go through? How do we use the techniques of chakra meditation to go through these various stages of mental and spiritual development. There's gonna be a lot of theory and there's gonna be a lot of practicum because yoga is nothing else if not practicum. It's a very practical system. So we hope that you'll join us uh, in this exploration of Patanjali's view of yoga and the development of the human being mentally and spiritually and the specific application of those ideas in chakra meditation. So we hope that you'll join us for A Yogi's Guide to Chakra Meditation. <music>